All right, so this is the remote control tracked vehicle I've been building. And this Ultra RC video, I'm going to show you what the components and stuff are, and then we're going to take it out and drive it around. I'll show you what it can do. So it's got this is the spare part for the hang long remote control tanks, and there's a hundred pieces of plastic track here with pins going through them each, and you can pull the pins out and change it any length that you want. These tracks are really grippy in sand and loose rocks and stuff, but when you get to plastic and other materials that tyres would be normally good on, these are just not very good. Like it will get stuck on the actual garden hose if you put it there. Now I have designed this to be a really good sort of crawler, as you can see it's got a good approach angle, um, I've got nice and lots of ground clearance under there, and I've kept the weight as low as possible. Originally the batteries were up here towards the front, and it made it really good at going up hills, but going down steps it would just have no hope. Eventually these batteries are going to be inside here, so it has nice and low weight, and that's going to be super awesome, but anyway. It's got two 2200 3 cell LiPo batteries there that power the two brushed ESCs. They have the fan on top and can take 3 cell, which is good, but they're just the cheap ones, really. And anyway, they just power the two brushed motors here with a 100 RPM gearbox that goes straight into the track and direct drive and super, super strong design. The actual frames, this aluminium um, L frame that's just bolted together with Meccano, makes it nice and strong and um, it's going to be super awesome. Now I'm going to change it up a bit, make it a bit lower, and it's going to be a digger eventually with a bobcat arm and it will be able to move sand and stuff because there's no point having lots of ground clearance and all this sort of approach angle and stuff when it can't really have any crawling power with these tracks. I do want to get spray on rubber and actually spray these tracks and then it'll be super awesome on rocks, but I'm not sure if that'll work. If I can find the spray on rubber, that will be a fun project. So it's on Elevon at the moment with the Turner GI6 receiver, channel 1 and channel 2, and then the other side of the remote will be used for the bobcat armor stuff. But at the moment, this is what it is. I hope you like it. I'm going to show you what it can do with a nice video of it driving around, and um, well, let's crack into that right now.